Imagine a world where colossal creatures ruled and then suddenly vanished without a trace. Picture this, a time when the world was a playground for gigantic beasts, where the ground trembled under their mighty steps. Dinosaurs, the masters of the planet for over 160 million years, then inexplicably, they were gone. This abrupt disappearance, this enigma wrapped in a mystery, has puzzled scientists and laymen alike for centuries. They were here one moment, ruling every corner of the globe, and then poof, they were gone, leaving behind only their fossilized remains as a testament to their reign. From the smallest Compsognathus to the towering Brachiosaurus, these magnificent creatures were wiped off the face of the earth. The question that has haunted us since we discovered their existence is, why? What cataclysmic event could have caused their extinction? What could have possibly caused these magnificent creatures to disappear from the face of the earth? In the early days of paleontology, theories about dinosaur extinction were rather simplistic. A fascinating era of discovery had just begun, and the scientists of the time were grappling with the enormity of what they were uncovering. There were colossal creatures that once roamed our planet, but were now nowhere to be found. The question was, why did they disappear? One of the earliest theories proposed was that of slow extinction due to climate change. It was thought that shifts in the Earth's temperature, changes in sea levels, or alterations in food supply might have gradually led to the demise of these mighty beasts. The world was evolving, and perhaps the dinosaurs simply couldn't keep up. Another theory was that diseases swept through the dinosaur populations, decimating them over time. It was a plausible idea. After all, we know that epidemics have played a significant role in shaping the course of life on Earth, even in human history. Then there was the competition theory. The idea here was that other animals and plants evolved and outcompeted the dinosaurs for resources. These new species were better adapted to the changing environments and were able to thrive where the dinosaurs could not. These early theories were straightforward and based on observable phenomena, but they lacked the dramatic flair that the extinction of such magnificent creatures seemed to demand. Yet, they were essential stepping stones on the path to understanding. They sparked curiosity and drove further investigation into the mystery of dinosaur extinction. These theories, while not entirely accurate, laid a foundation for the scientific investigation that was to come. They were the starting point, the first attempts to explain one of nature's most intriguing puzzles. They set the stage for the more complex and nuanced theories that scientists would develop as they delved deeper into the past, piecing together the story of the dinosaurs and their untimely end. In 1980, a groundbreaking theory emerged that shook the world of paleontology. This was the asteroid impact theory, a hypothesis that sought to explain the sudden disappearance of dinosaurs from our planet. This theory was largely based on the discovery of the Chicxulub crater, an immense depression off the coast of Mexico's Yucatan Peninsula. Approximately 120 miles in diameter and 12 miles deep, this crater was the result of an asteroid or comet collision. The force of this impact would have been equivalent to a billion Hiroshima atomic bombs, releasing a shockwave of energy that would have incinerated everything in its path. But the destruction didn't stop there. The impact would have sent billions of tons of debris into the atmosphere, blocking out sunlight and causing a nuclear winter effect. This sudden drop in temperature and light would have been devastating to the dinosaurs, disrupting their food chains and leading to mass extinction. The asteroid impact theory was not just based on the presence of the Chicxulub crater, but also on the discovery of a global layer of iridium. This rare element is found in high concentrations in asteroids, but is much less common on Earth. In the late Cretaceous period layer of rock, around the time of the dinosaurs' extinction, scientists found an iridium layer up to 30 times thicker than normal. This discovery provided strong evidence that an asteroid or comet impact 
occurred around the time of the dinosaur's demise. But what about the dinosaurs that survived the initial impact? Well, the theory suggests that the after-effects of the impact, including the nuclear winter and the disruption of food chains, would have made survival incredibly difficult. Over time, even the hardiest of dinosaurs would have succumbed to these harsh conditions. This catastrophic event, according to many scientists, could have been the final blow for the dinosaurs. This theory, while not without its critics, has gone a long way in helping us understand the sudden disappearance of these magnificent creatures from our world. But the asteroid impact is not the only theory. Some scientists believe that massive volcanic activities could have played a major role. Dive with me into this alternative explanation, the volcanic activity theory. This theory revolves around the Deccan Traps, a vast region in what is now modern-day India. This region is known for its extensive volcanic rock formations, which are a testament to a period of intense volcanic activity that occurred around the same time as the dinosaurs' demise. Now, picture this. Over a span of a few hundred thousand years, a series of colossal volcanic eruptions, each one more powerful than the last, spewed enormous quantities of molten lava onto the Earth's surface. These eruptions were so intense that they covered an area as large as the present-day United States. But it wasn't just the lava that posed a threat. The real danger lay in the gases and particles that these eruptions released into the atmosphere. Volcanoes, as we know, release a cocktail of gases during an eruption, including carbon dioxide and sulfur dioxide. The theory posits that the sheer volume of these gases could have drastically altered the Earth's climate. The sulfur dioxide would have formed aerosols in the atmosphere, blocking sunlight and causing a dramatic drop in temperatures, a scenario often referred to as a volcanic winter. On the other hand, the carbon dioxide would have led to a gradual warming of the Earth over a longer period, a phenomenon we know today as global warming. This rapid cooling and subsequent slow warming would have wreaked havoc on the Earth's ecosystems, leading to massive die-offs and eventually the extinction of the dinosaurs. So, was it the impact of an asteroid or massive volcanic eruptions that led to the extinction of dinosaurs? Or could it have been a combination of both? It's a question that continues to ignite the curiosity of scientists and laymen alike, a riddle that time has yet to fully unravel. Even today, the debate continues with new evidence and theories emerging. As we delve into the ongoing discourse, we find that the mystery of dinosaur extinction continues to perplex scientists, researchers and enthusiasts alike. Newer theories are taking shape, adding layers of complexity to the enigma. For instance, some scientists propose a shift in the planet's ecosystem due to climate change, which could have led to a gradual decline in the population of these colossal creatures. Others suggest a potential disease outbreak that might have swept across the dinosaur population, causing them to perish in large numbers. There's also the Deccan Traps theory, which postulates that massive volcanic eruptions in what is now India could have led to their demise. These eruptions would have released immense quantities of dust and gases into the atmosphere, causing a drastic change in climate and leading to a mass extinction event. Research in the field is ceaseless, with scientists using state-of-the-art technology to unearth and analyze new evidence. This includes studying fossil records, examining geological layers and even using advanced computer models to simulate possible scenarios. Each piece of evidence, every new discovery, brings us a step closer to unraveling this age-old mystery. Yet, despite the multitude of theories and extensive research, the exact cause of dinosaur extinction remains elusive. It's a puzzle that keeps scientists up at night a riddle that continues to captivate our collective curiosity. It's one of the greatest mysteries in science, a question that humankind has been trying to answer for centuries. While it's possible that a combination of factors led to their extinction, we may never know the full story. But that's the beauty of science. It's an endless journey of discovery, a constant quest for knowledge. 
And as we continue to explore, to question, to probe, we learn more about our world and our place within it. While the mystery continues to intrigue us, one thing is certain. The extinction of dinosaurs drastically changed the course of life on Earth. In the span of this video, we've journeyed through time, exploring the various theories surrounding the extinction of dinosaurs. We've delved into the early speculations, considering the intriguing possibilities of climatic changes, diseases, or even competition with other species leading to their demise. Our journey took us to the striking asteroid impact theory, where a catastrophic event may have drastically altered the Earth's environment and led to their extinction. The volcanic activity theory also made a compelling case, suggesting that prolonged volcanic eruptions might have created an inhospitable world for these magnificent beings. The debate, as we've seen, is far from over. Scientists around the globe continue to dig, research and argue, each new discovery adding a layer of complexity to this prehistoric puzzle. The extinction of dinosaurs serves as a stark reminder of the impermanence of life and the ever-changing nature of our planet. As we continue to unearth more about our planet's past, perhaps one day we'll finally uncover the truth behind the disappearance of these colossal creatures.